What's up everybody? Before we get into this video, I had to film a little segment. I gotta be quiet because the boys are sleeping. But just in the time it took me to film this and edit this video in the same day, in about an eight hour time frame, I sold another $330 worth of stuff on eBay. That puts me at $4,000 in eBay sales in one month, most of it being in the last two weeks. I'm more than doubled my money from this Amazon return palette. It's crazy. This is absolutely crazy. Make sure you let me know in the comments if you enjoy these videos and I will keep making them because this is gonna be a pretty good side hustle if I keep it up. So let's get into this video. Check out some of the random stuff I've been selling. I can't even put everything into this video, but I'll show you the highlights. Enjoy the video, make sure you comment below. Oh yeah! What's up everybody, welcome to Shill Outdoors. I'm Brad, and on this channel we do a wide variety of things. Today, I'm gonna talk about how I capitalized on my Amazon return palette that I got about three weeks ago, and in the last two weeks, I've made almost four grand on eBay. So to recap, in the last couple of years, in the spring when I don't have a lot going on, I buy Amazon return palettes, and then I was selling that stuff on marketplace and local sales. I was not using eBay at all. This year, and those were smaller pallets, this year I bought a $10,000 pallet and I started utilizing eBay to try to open up to a bigger base of people. I am only 15 days into selling on eBay, 15 days today, and I'm around 3,700 on eBay, and then I've made a little bit on Facebook Marketplace and direct sales directly to people. Today's video, I'm gonna show you the items that I got in that pallet that sold very quickly. Obviously, I've only been doing this two weeks, and I mean, most stuff that was selling sold within 24 hours of posting it. eBay is coming in clutch, opening me up to a lot of people and helping me bring in some profit. Before we get into the video, make sure you comment below if you like seeing these kind of videos. Let me know if I need to keep filming this. It takes a lot of time to film them and to edit them. Is this something you wanna see? Is it something that you're interested in? So comment below if I should keep it up or if I should just move on to the next project. But let's go ahead and get into this video. Cool, I'm gonna move to the side here and I'll show you screenshots right here of the items that sold and for how much and uh, hopefully give you guys a better idea of the exact product so I'm not just saying it. So what I did to learn eBay and to learn how to ship is I was actually, I was selling fishing lures, like extra lures that I had and I made my first eBay sale was February 15th, so one month ago today. I sold my first thing on eBay. I sold 11 pairs of fishing lures for about 15 to $20 each. And I was trying to learn the process, trying to learn how to ship things. It, it was good though to make those little sales and learn the process. So the first item I sold out of my Amazon return pallet was, it was very obscure. It was a cable that you repair a like rolling RV door with, like a roll up door. It was a cable, like a tension cable. It was a pair that I had and they sold individually for $25. I sold the pair for $25 with free shipping. So the first item, only $25 and it sold within like three hours. So then I started going into higher dollar stuff. So I had a Vive wireless adapter full pack. It was not vo virtual reality. It's just accessories that go to a virtual reality. It was in really good shape. I sold it for $290. The next thing I had was Wallabot DIY stud finders. So these are like, it's like a little thing you put on the back of your phone, you run it around the wall, and it like shows you, hey, this is a metal stud, a wood stud, things like that. I sold one for $70. I sold one for $60. Made 70 and 60 out of those. ERX Go Training Suspension Trainer Kit. So this was like a kit that you do like pull-ups, or like you put it in a door frame and I think you can do like body weight rows. That thing costs normally about 130 bucks. We sold it for $90. I had in this palette two Fossil smartwatches, one men's, one women's. The men's had the box, the charging cord, everything. A Fossil Gen 5 Juliana stainless black steel touchscreen smartwatch. Sold that bad boy for $150 in like a day. Also, let me just say, I was only listing like one or two items a day because when I got the Amazon pallet, I didn't have a lot of time to go through everything. So what I had to do is I bought the Amazon return pallet, I brought it home. It actually sat in my garage for like three days before I did anything with it. So what you have to do with these Amazon returns is even if they're brand new in the plastic, even if they are not even opened, I have to open them 
and make sure everything's in there. I have to make sure I don't sell something to somebody that's not fully, you know, involved or fully there or fully like, uh, like everything's in the packing. So I have to go through every single item, turn on every single item, plug everything in. It's a lot of manpower, but it's totally worth it when you make those $150 sales, $200 sales, $1,500 sales. So on this particular item, it was, uh, I sold a bunch of wireless headphones. That took me about two days to go through 10 sets of wireless headphones, make sure they were all charged, plug them into my laptop, plug them into the PS4, all that good stuff to make sure that they had good connectivity. But then it started paying off. I sold a HyperX Cloud Flight wireless, $79. Steel Series Arctis One wireless gaming headset, $75. Those both are about $100 to $110 new. I was selling them for about 80 to 85% value. Then I sold the camera. So the camera was a Sony A7 triple I DSLR camera, just the body. I didn't have a battery, I didn't have a box. It was the, the body and the instruction booklet. That is a $1,700 setup. I sold it for $1,500 flat, $1,500. Now let's talk about those eBay fees and let's talk about shipping. eBay fees on that was about 11% or whatever. 13%, whatever you want to say. Let's just pretend eBay kept $175 of that. And then plus my shipping was like $40. So between shipping and eBay fees, I only technically made $1,300 on that item. But I mean, who can complain about $1,300 when I only paid $1,471 for the pallet? So don't forget eBay fees. eBay fees and shipping cut me down about 13 to 15% of whatever I sell the item for. But again, if I sell something for 100 bucks, I'm putting $80 in my pocket still. So then I sold an HDMI four-way um, splitter, multi-viewer, $100 brand new, made $70 for that, sold some more lures. Then I had these radios, so I had two scanners. The first one that sold, a Uniden Bearcat 500 channel handheld scanner. This is used by like uh, volunteer firefighters, some EMS personnel use it, security, even like a reserve police officer can use this and scan local channels. Now you won't get all channels. A lot of police channels are encrypted and you cannot get these on these without certain um, trunking or whatever it's called, without certain access. So you won't get everything. You won't hear like every local police channel, but you can get a lot of stuff, especially just like local radio frequencies. This first one sells brand new for about 130. I sold it for $100 flat. Everything was in the box, brand new, perfect condition. Plastic on the screen and everything. Made $100 on that one. And then we sold a $425 scanner. So this one is a Uniden Home Patrol Series Bearcat Trunk Tracker V Police. This sucker sells $500 brand new. I posted it for $450. And a gentleman asked me, hey, would you take $425? And I said, yeah, I'll take $425. It cost me $17 to ship it, fully insured with a signature, $17 to ship. So after eBay fees and shipping, I'll pocket about $380, $375 out of that sucker. And then the last thing I sold was Astro A50 headphones. These are wireless headphones. These headphones were just in the plastic. They were in a plastic baggie, like a Ziploc baggie. They had a charger a home to like a uh, home station and I didn't know anything about these I put them to the side I didn't even look at them for almost two weeks when I looked them up I saw that they are three hundred dollars brand new three hundred dollars brand new for this wireless headset so I charged them up I plugged them into my computer I got them all set up I had to like you know uh, link them to my computer and wouldn't you know it they work just Fine. I let them play for almost an hour to ensure that they held connectivity. I listed them for 150, somebody offered me 135 and I took it. So even after eBay fees and shipping on that one, I'll profit about 105, 108 dollars. So in one month I've made about four grand. I made about 3,500 just from the Amazon return palette in two weeks. Now I need to know if you guys like this video. If you like this video, make sure you comment below and ask me to do more. I still have over a hundred items in the garage. I need to decide if I'm gonna buy more of these pallets. I'll probably do garage sales or local sales for a lot of the 10, 20, $30 items that I can't make as much money on. But if you guys wanna see me continue to do these videos, let me know because it takes a lot of time to film them and edit it and all that good stuff. I'm gonna keep the side hustle going it just depends on if you guys want to watch it. So let me know in the comments below. Thank you so much for being here.